gonna say, no way. Who can seal, dude? You. Good morning, everybody. You're back fishing with Zach and David. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> and today we're fishing in Newport Harbor. Um, check it out. Check it out. Check it out. Check it out. So we just launched. Um, we're gonna stay in the harbor today. Uh, we're gonna fish for spotted bay bass. We're gonna do some doing some tournament fishing in a few months, so we just kind of want to get out, and get our bearings back, and, and make it happen. Uh, I'll go over what gear we're gonna use, uh, what the baits we're gonna use, and uh, hopefully we're gonna get into some fish too. Um, but it's it's a pretty sweet harbor. I haven't been out here in a long time fishing, and I'm glad to be back. So uh, I'm glad you're coming along. We'll see you soon. Oh, come on. Yeah, bud. Damn. Damn, I gotta switch to the Oh, oh yeah! Something likes it. That's a fish. It's a 1,000 size reel is what it is. <laughs> <laughs> I told you, I think something is biting it. I think so. we're getting hit on the surface. Maybe it? It could be. When we're, we're throwing, when we're throwing stuff that small, uh, I think it's bass. Honestly. Oh, bass. Nice bass. Very nice. What did I tell you about spotties? <laughs> what did I tell you? <laughs> so, guys, we're. We're fighting this spotted bass. I'm on a 1,000 size reel and four pound line, so right, I can't. There's no muscle in the fish up in this situation. Probably should have caught it All right, this is what we came for. This is a spotted bay bass. They only live in Southern California and Baja. So very little home range. I love catching these fish. Um, it's catch and release only. This is a pretty decent fish. I'm gonna guess this is like a 12 incher. And look at what this guy ate. Look at what he ate. So that's one of those little inch and a half grubs in our PB flavor. Um, on one of our jig heads as well. Gorgeous fish, we're gonna let him go. I'm gonna take the bait out of his mouth first <laughs> and then we're gonna let him go. Uh, okay, so caught our target species, really happy about it. We're gonna let this guy go, okay? There he goes, awesome. Let's see if we get another one. All right, so today while we're out um, fishing for those bass, I wanted to show everybody uh, the baits that we're using. So today we're going to use a small drop shot, like it's like a kind of a three inch shiner, real small finesse bait. Uh, I have a couple different uh, scents on board, so we'll see which one kind of gets into it the best. I'm also thinking about using these little tiny, tiny finesse swim baits. They're like little grubs, same thing, scented as well. Um, I'll throw that on the little baby jig head. Um, and then we're also going to be using some bigger swim baits. Um, the bigger swim baits. And then we have the bigger swim baits as well. Um, so some of them pretty mod, pretty pretty large. Uh, uh, we'll put on a half ounce head and uh, kind of get into it from there. We just got to kind of feel it out, see what's working best, see what colors working best, see what scents working best. Um, and you know that's what makes fishing great so um, hopefully we'll see you soon and uh, with some fish on the boat uh, I was about to be like holy shit it's still no it's not a fish I think we're over a giant seaweed bed no way! What? what? No! What? 
That's an octopus? That is an octopus. What the hell? <laughs> Holy crap. <laughs> Are you serious? Holy crap. I, have, I don't even know what to do right now. Uh, just avoid the middle. Yeah, he's, that bite like a... So guys, uh, baits work. <laughs> Caught an octopus. I don't even understand. That's insane. This thing is cool. Oh, shit. How cool, dude. Oh. Well. He's still, he's really trying to take my bait. Like, he's like, he's not gonna let it go. Look at this guy. Look at him. A little hitchhiker. That's funny. All right. Well, octopus, I want my bait back. So, life. That's probably. There he goes. Oh. Yeah, All right, guys. It is. <laughs> that, so that octopus was caught on one of these little inch and a half grubs, uh, and the flavor uh, is it's called PB flavor. Um, on a 16 ounce uh, jig head that we make. Um, that was cool. Let's see if we get another one. So what's going on right now is that David and I are fishing this bridge, this structure here, and we're hitting the pylons on each side of it. When we got here, the tide was slack, so we could use uh, really small lead heads, 16th ounce lead heads. Um, and it, it's worked great, we, we've got into fish. Um, but the tide is starting to move out now. And the problem is, is when you have a little tiny uh, jig head like that, a metal like that, when the tide's moving, it keeps the bait from sinking to the bottom like we want it to. So we're gonna have to switch it up. We're gonna have to go to something heavier. I'm probably gonna move to a drop shot with a three uh, eighths ounce drop shot weight just to get it down there enough. We'll see what happens. Spotticus Maximus. Don't bite me. Just like that. Don't bite me. All right. So, another beautiful spotted bass. Gorgeous. This one's not legal. Legal size on uh, spotted bass is 14 inches. Um, this guy's probably, I'm going to guess, 10 to 12. So, great fish, super fun fighting. Uh, let's go put him back really quick. There he goes. So, that was, uh, he bit on this guy. This is one of the Pacific Bait baits. Um, this is a three inch little drop shot, kind of like a shiner. Um, this one was in our PB scent. 
uh, fish to drop shot style. So uh, about that far from the a three eighth ounce weight. Um, awesome fish. It was great. Let's see if we get some more. Oh, there we go! Yes! Yes! Yes, that's a fish! Yeah! <laughs> awesome, dude. So for that. Hey, I'm filming. I'm filming for you. There you go, Dave. Spotty? Nice! Awesome! How oh, awesome, man. Let's see this guy. <laughs> I worked so hard for that one. Hey, man, that's how it goes. That's something like that. Shows the fish. Nice spotty, dude. See you later. Okay. Dave just just got on while we were uh, moving spots, just getting is on the a, bottom. It's a barracuda. That is a. It's a juvenile that's barracuda. It's a juvenile barracuda. <laughs> wow. He smoked your bait too. Yeah. yeah. Just well, Let me see if he's 22 inches. Public service announcement. Dude. Uh, tell tell everybody how how long a barracuda has to be a keep. It's gotta be uh, 22 inches. Yep. We're a little uh, away from that. You're a little short there. <laughs> hey, buddy, hey, I, I'm, I'm trying to do this. You're doing surgery. As quickly as possible, my dude. You annihilate. Dude, you smell like barracuda. <laughs> <laughs> it's got this, like, stank to it. Great time. Just released that barracuda. What a great time. Let's get back and get another one. These guys are similar to the uh, Barracuda. They also have to be 22 inches. Actually, now that memory is serving me correct, I think Barracuda is supposed to be 28. I think Barracuda is 28 too. So, correction here, Barracuda is actually 28. The Halibut is actually what's supposed to be 22. So he's got a long ways to go. So I'm gonna just go safely release him here. And there he goes. He's not a neutral. <laughs> That's hilarious. Second barracuda of the day in Newport Harbor. <laughs> there you go. All right, guys. So, second barracuda of the day in Newport Harbor. Can you see it? All right, cool. Uh, wow, talk about unexpected. Check that guy out. He's got some some teeth on him. Can you see him? Cool. So these gotta be 28 inches to keep. Obviously not 28 inches, but still super fun. Uh, awesome fish. Cool, we're gonna let him go. There he goes. There you go. Nice. This is too much for this point. Oh my god. Oh yeah, you got something there, dude. How does it feel? <laughs> like a seal. Go away, seal. No, 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 get away, get away. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. 
Is he right there? He's right there. Oh, no. Oh, come on, come on. If you want to live, buddy, come with me. Oh, my goodness. Don't eat my hand fucking. <laughs> wow. Oh. Oh, nice dude, fish, dude. He bit you twice. Oh my god. Nice dude. fish, dude. Wow. Okay. Oh yeah. Let me, get, let me get some of that. Nice. That is a calico. Wow, dude. Tell us about it. So that calico uh, is legal fish is 14 inches. That is uh, easily a 14 inch fish. Legal calico, having a great time, Newport Harbor, uh, on a little swim bait, just having a great, dude, just enjoying the day, man. All right. Enjoying the day. I'm gonna let, I'm gonna let him go on this side. Yeah, be, there's a lot of seals hanging out, so. Go, buddy. Oh, he's gone. Perfect. He's gone. All right. <laughs> nice fish, man. Thank great, you, sir. Great fish. I just got it. Yep. <laughs> on the fall. I know. I was dude, on the fall. Yeah, this spot, it's like they have to be because it's like anything that falls, they gotta eat it right then and there. Little calico. So this is a baby version of what uh, what David just caught. So we'll let him go nice and easy. Later. All right. I was like right here too. The bite just turned on. Little calico? Little calico. Nice, dude. Little Dugan. And another calico, just every other cast right now on these swim baits. Swim baits seem to be the be the the trick right now. Yeah. There you go. This seems to be the nice spot. Yeah. Little guy. Nice little calico. There he goes. All right. I just wanted to thank everybody for tuning in for another great day of fishing. Um, what an amazing day. Mixed bag, barracuda, bass, all different kinds of bass, even a little halibut. I mean, it doesn't get better than that. Um, really, really fun. Dave killed it with that giant calico, my man. And uh, yeah, we've had a great day getting harassed by uh, all the seals. So um, thank you again. Uh, do me a favor. You could like and subscribe. It helps the channel out. It helps me out. It helps Dave out. And uh, yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Thank you.